Ugh. Once again, feminists have bullied someone into thinking they're a lesser person just because of their shirt or something like that. Uh, before I get into this rant, I just want to give you a bit of background as to what this man has done. This man's name is Dr. Matt Taylor, a project scientist at the Rosa uh, European Space Agency. <sighs> anyway, if you haven't heard about what this man and a few other scientists have managed to accomplish, they have landed a spacecraft on a comet, which is a huge step forward for mankind. With this advancement, we can actually measure the density and thermal properties of comets and gain information as to what organic co compounds can be found on a comet. But instead, we lost sight of what really matters. <sighs> this man should be elated, but instead he had been bullied by feminists because of the graphic nature of his shirt that depicts women as sex objects. Really? Grow the fuck up. You have completely lost sight of what is truly important. It's like, hmm, what's more important? Landing a comet? On a comet, I should say. Or making someone feel degraded because of their choice of clothing. I think the choice is pretty obvious. Maybe not everyone thinks like this, but the fuck? This is ridiculous. I mean, it... <sighs> I'll post some things in the description and his interview about uh, where he actually breaks down into tears while they're talking about this. And he actually says stuff like, I know it was a mistake. And you shouldn't have to feel like that for even a second. Because this is, this is actually a huge, huge accomplishment. I don't understand it. It's like, Feminists have been ruining a lot of things, and just to be clear, I'm not against equal rights for any individual, but, you know, sometimes they take it shit too, too far. This is definitely one of those times. I mean, what, what do we have to do to get this? I mean, maybe I can make a whole video on why things, how things could be completely worse. I don't know. I don't even know if that would get to any of them, to be honest with you. This, this is actually kind of the reason why I'm so depressed. People go, you know, it's probably because you stay in your room all day or something. I go, fuck, no, it's not. <laughs> I can't even get out of bed when I see shit like this. Like, when I wake up, and get out of bed just for a second when you look on the computer and I see something as fucking ridiculous as this. It's it disgusts me. I I don't know. I don't know why people are like this. I mean it'd be one thing if it were like it was just uh, let me explain to you what the shirt is. It was just a woman with like her ass showing here and then a few other pictures of this image replicated across the shirt. That's so bad. Wow. You know what? That's right. I looked at that and I became a misogynist. Just, that's it. Just, that's it. Because that's all it takes. I don't know what the fuck else to say. I mean, I could sit here all day and trash on why this is bullshit. On why he should be happy and not, even, even for that, like, few moments of that interview feel broken down and disheveled but nope of course not we can't have that we can't we can't let someone be happy for that type of an accomplishment just because they have this shirt on or they have a a little bit of i guess you could say some thought-provoking clothing it just it just breaks me like i'm trying like, it's taking everything I have to wrap my mind around what is going on, but I can't even. I don't understand. Like, if I if I walked outside with that type of shirt on, do you think I'd be stopped? The answer is most likely, because people are just completely forgot about uh, freedom of expression, which is something I hold very dear. I mean, people told me while I was in high school, you can't wear chains. I told them to go fuck themselves. What did I do? I wore chains. And we have all these stupid 
coding policy, co clothing policies or regulations in schools and workplaces. And I mean, obviously, in this place, he could wear whatever he wants. And he fucking should be able to. He's an adult. He shouldn't feel bad for being an adult. <sighs> anyway, I've come up with a slogan for the Earth. I'm going to leave on this. Welcome to Earth. Stay for the atmosphere. Leave because of the impossibly rapid increase in human stupidity. Peace out.